in my many years of producing theater, um, I was, it was such a gift to me to be able to witness uh, change, change on an emotional level, on a mental level, uh, on a spiritual level, and also a physical level of healing. Um, one example, we, I worked with artists uh, living with and without disabilities and deaf artists, hearing artists, and one particular artist, Neil Marcus, who had a very serious, uh, severe disability uh, called dystonia. We toured that show six years internationally, and every night we did that show, it changed audiences. I got to watch that from the back of the house. Talk about a gift. But not only did it change audiences, it changed Neil. He wasn't supposed to live past his 20s because of his disability. He just recently passed at 66. It, it, it en enlivened him. The love, the focus, the energy that he got back on a constant level from audiences literally raised him up in a way that was goosebump inducing for the audience and for him. And I watched his physical condition improve and change and his stamina grow and expand to the point where we could do a 90 minute show and another 45 minute Q&A with the audience afterwards and he was still going. Whereas at the beginning he had about a 20 minute energy span. So that's just one example of how arts Art can save lives, and art certainly can change lives. And I, I want to weave all of that and continue to weave that into my visual art as well.